everybody, welcome back to the channel. Say hi. <coughs> we are here, Dallas is here. And welcome back to Vlogtober. Not sure which day it is because this is also a pre recorded video. So, whenever Vlogtober day it is, we'll have it scroll up on the screen. Tell everybody what we're going to do today. I'm going to make caramel. Um, wait. We're going to make caramel apple grapes. So, <clears throat> fun fall treat for kids to do something easy to keep the kids entertained. So, Dallas is going to make the kids' version, and I am going to make an adult version that can be used for a nice get together or a party. So, my grapes have actually been sitting in coconut rum overnight. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But these are for grown ups. Right. I'm gonna drain it. See if I do this without making a mess. Hey, I want to do that. No, that's adult kids. Not for kids. Okay. So, let's show them what we're gonna do. Let's see. <coughs> So for this, you're going to need some green grapes, some crushed peanuts, and some melted caramel. You can also use any other toppings you want, it's like, but we're just going to use peanuts and caramel. So take your grape and put a toothpick in the top. You put the toothpick in. Let's yeah. see. And then we're going to dip it in the caramel. Get a nice caramel coating on there. Ooh. And then you dip it in the peanuts. So the concept is to, <laughs> to make it look like a caramel apple. Um, what are we doing now? Now you put it on your plate. So it can dry. Well, I'm going to put mine in here so they don't get mixed up. Just put it on your plate. <coughs> oh, it's going to dry. Mm -hmm. okay. You can get another one. I just wanted to eat the stuff. Look, you got to get another one. Don't spit it back out. <laughs> Might be a good idea to let the kids have their own separate caramel and peanuts and grapes so you're not sharing whatever it is you're putting on there these are some big grapes they're like um, um, they're, um, they're gonna be giant, they are giant they're like um, not uh holding on to my toothpick uh -oh. it, it sticks out it sticks out yeah I'm not saying that I gotta put my hand in my mouth, right? No. No? That's so good. No, you'll do this. Don't do that. Uh-huh. Gotta do that. We're actually using some cocktail parasols. <laughs> because I have these only toothpicks that I have. So we can actually make these a little festive. Make it. Did you take that out of my thing? Stop. <laughs> We're going to, uh. Make it cute. Make it tropical. Hey. Hey. Okay, I wish I can do that. Oh, you can get one. One second. Okay. So you can use regular the caramel candies. Um, I just figured this caramel bucket would be easier okay. than to try. try to keep putting candy in because this is already like soft and I just put it in the microwave for like 30 seconds just to get it softer but uh you can do it you can do it that way to make it a little bit more easier so let us know in the comments do you like caramel apples or do you like the regular hard red candy apples um I like caramel you like caramel no I really like those. those um 
candy apples are getting so much more like glamorous nowadays. So many different toppings. When we were in Florida and we were at the um, Adventure Mall, Adventure Mall in um, Miami or Fort Lauderdale, they had a place that had candy apples and there's like so many different things you can put on there it's crazy okay do it over the bucket though oh see and dallas got creative he did too yeah you can do whatever you want you can put candy candy or whatever kind of candy you want pop on the plate you can put on the plate yes so we're gonna do a few more. Let them get a little bit hard. I, I am. And we'll be back. Hmm? Oh. Well, okay. Go. We're all done. We yeah. have a few more groups left, but for the most part, we're done. These are mine. These are the adult ones. And these are Dallas's. He's been eating his. Oh, he only has a few left. <laughs> and you can put them in the refrigerator for like 30 minutes or whatever to, um, Get your caramel a little bit softer. I'm not caramel. This is caramel. Want to taste it? Uh huh. Yes. Not this one. You gotta taste yours. I'm gonna taste mine. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. That's so good. Uh, I'm allergic to peanuts. You're allergic to peanuts. You are not. But he brings up a good point. If you're making this for a party, definitely make sure you ask if anybody has a nut allergy. And then you can just substitute it for something else instead of the peanuts. But normally, you know, in fall time, you go to the apple orchards and you get some caramel apples. That is so good. Great. And it's like just the adult version. You can use any alcohol that you want. It absorbs it nicely. Um, it's not overbearing where it's like, uh, but you can definitely taste it. It's really good. You like it? You show them what yours look like? Over here. Tasty. <gasps> He's eaten quite a few of them. So, he'll be on a sugar high in a little bit. <laughs> so, yes, these are caramel apple grapes. Mm -hmm. or boozy caramel apple grapes depending on which version you make give them a try let us know how you like them thank you so much for watching we will see you tomorrow for vlogtober day <laughs> give dallas a like if you are not subscribed subscribe to my channel so, thumbs up and uh we'll see you tomorrow Goodbye. no thumbs down <laughs> thumbs up <laughs> uh,